to make a habit of empathy, to recognize ourselves in each other. Okay. All right, so this, this is the story for me that has to do with empathy being the basis of integrity in action. Okay. Uh, and it's a story about Gandhi. Uh, and I was told that it was a true story. I'm sure I've paraphrased it over the years as stories go, but I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is true to the story. That a mother in India had a son, about 12 years old, who had a severe case of diabetes. And uh, she could not get her son to stop eating sugar. And, and he you know, was at risk of dying or going into coma. And no matter what she did, she couldn't get him to stop eating sugar. So finally, as an act of desperation, she was able to get an audience with Gandhi. She took her son to Gandhi and explained the whole situation, saying, my son has severe diabetes and sugar will kill him, and I cannot get him to stop eating sugar. Can you help? And Gandhi looked at the boy and looked at the mother and said, come back in five days. So she left, um, and five days later she came back and said, uh, I've brought my son back here and we've waited five days. Can you now say something to help me, to help, help my son? And Gandhi looks at the boy and he says, stop eating sugar. And the mother goes, stop eating sugar, that's, that's it? And he says, yes, stop eating sugar. And she says, well, if I, I don't mean to be disrespectful, but if that's all you were going to say to him, why did we have to wait five days? And he said, five days ago, I still ate sugar. <laughs>